Good afternoon, everyone. Happy Super Bowl Eve. This is Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We're doing a uh, half case break of 17-18 Panini status basketball. This is break number two, 10 boxes, random teams. Now, now that this is over, at the very end of the break, as it says in the item description, which, which I'm sure everybody read, after breaks one and two sell out, we'll randomize both lists. So there'll be 60 names, right, or 60 spots there. Both lists, we'll randomize that name. The name on top wins four Super Bowl squares in our Superb Owl promo, or Superb Owl squares promo. I can't say Super Bowl. I'll get in trouble. Um, okay, so big thanks to these folks involved in the second half. And there are all the teams right there. Seven times. One and a six. We'll randomize each list seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven times, we've got Paul down to William. And then one and a six, seven times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven times, we got the Cavs on top and the Nets on the bottom. Yeah, that superb Owl Square promo almost done, folks. So go to jazbeeshobbyland.com and check it out. Be sure, if you have a chance tonight, be sure to watch the live stream because we are playing, uh, I am play I set up a, a all Super Bowl halftime music set list, checklist, set list, song list today. All right, Paul, you got the Cavs, Nathan with the Suns, Gary with the Celtics, Chris with the Timberwolves, Matt with the Rockets, Jeremy uh, with the 76ers, Ryan with the Kings, Mark with the Nuggets and Lakers, Jeff with the Hawks, Mark with the Grizzlies, William with the Bulls, Mark with the Bucks, Jeremy with the Trailblazers, William with the Magic, Jeremy with the Pacers, D-Mac with the Spurs, Mark with the Thunder, Jason with the Knicks, Matt with the Raptors, Cosmo, you got the Heat, William with the Pelicans and the Jazz, Mavs with, uh, for Chris Parent, Peter, you have the Hornets, William with the Warriors, Jeremy with the Wizards, Matt with the Pistons, Ryan with the Clippers, and William with the Nets. And William has a Golden State for Portland trade up if, uh, if Jeremy Merle is here. All right, so let me know if there's any trades. Um, here are the here are all ten. There's five on the left side, five on the right side, right there. And you remember my Wolverine scratches right here, so you know they're from the same case. All right, so trade away, folks. Eagles flu-like symptoms all week. Yeah, they're on IV. Oh. All right, doesn't look like there's going to be any trades, so let's close up that trade window. TWC means trade window closed, so we'll just go with that list. Sorry, fat package. Status basketball. One autograph per box on average is what we're looking for. Obviously, the rookie class this year has been pretty strong. Pretty exciting, so. It's been doing pretty well in the secondary market, which I've been happy about. So, there it is. On a Saturday, the list remains the same. Good luck to everybody. And we'll, the randomizer for the Superb Owl Squares will be at the very end of this video. Should probably have my knife ready to go. My tools of the trade, not ready. Now I'm ready. Hopefully I have enough supplies here too. We'll wing it. We'll do it live. It's sad. It's Saturday. This is my Friday anyway, so. We'll keep it fun. We'll keep it loose. We'll do a lot of breaks. And, uh, and then we'll discuss the Super Bowl, obviously. We'll go.
go from there. Uh, looks like Browns and Panthers are left in Panini Vertex football, says Steel Curtain. That is also our last, uh, our last chance, your last chance at Vertex to get a Super Bowl square. And then after that, it'll be Chronicles Basketball. And then that's it. That is it. And once we get the promo knocked out, then we could maybe hopefully uh, knock out some other breaks that are on the site. Topps Chrome Baseball would be a good one to do tonight. There's some other breaks that we could knock out too. Uh, no, I did not see the legs of that Suns player, Isaiah Kanan, I think. I didn't want to see it, Arthur. Yeah, we'll, 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 talk, we'll talk props and everything too. All right, so let's see. My hand's going to be right about there. All right, good luck, everybody. Here we go. We got 77 out of 77, Anthony Davis. Really love the design of these, of these cards. I think it's at a nice price point, too. Nice, friendly price point. There's Kobe. Nice. There's Magic Johnson to 199. Nice status quo insert. And nice for the Warriors. Elite signatures, Tim Hardaway. Wasn't William trying to trade the Warriors? Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. There you go. Tyler Lydon for the Nuggets out of 299. We'll sleeve and top load all of those, those up a little bit later. We'll try to save some of the rookie cards for the top, top players. Um, all those rookie cards will ship anyway, but we'll try to sleeve those up too. Out of 199, Jimmy Butler for the T-Wolves, Malik Monk. Out of 199, there's Ryan Anderson. Even these Ben Simmons are, are, are doing, can do relative, to, could do relatively well. I don't know about this specific set, but I know traditionally, even his second year stuff does okay, because he has no autographs in, the, in these sets. He's exclusive to Upper Deck. All right. Xbox on that side. All right, good luck, everybody. So I know, I know, uh, we're doing a basketball break. Generally, we like to talk basketball during a basketball break, but. I'll make an exception today. It's a, the big game is tomorrow, so I know we all want to talk about the Super Bowl. Um, what does everyone think about the game? Who do you think is going to win? Does uh, does everyone has anyone's mind changed one way or the other over the last two weeks? GCL says betting on the Pats is like betting on Mayweather. It's a lock. Did you know that that of all the Super Bowls that the Patriots have been involved in? I think they've only, I think they've only like covered like two or three times or something like that. I have to look that up, but I I don't I don't think they've, I don't think they have covered very often. Now, regular season, they're always they they always seem to cover, but Super Bowl is different. Oh, why was that backwards? Oh, that's why. Out of two ninety nine. Why is that number there? Got some nice inserts here too. I dig it. Tim Duncan? Autograph? No, see? Come on, Panini. Trolling me. Trolling me. Tricksters. Nice Markel Fultz. Out of 149. DeMarcus Cousins. Oh, poor Achilles. 
The uh, Markel Fultz obviously will go, that rookie, what is it called? Rookie credentials will go to the uh, Sixers, Jeremy Merle. I wouldn't be surprised if parallels of that could help you pay for that spot. Wow, nice. Eight out of ten. Eight out of ten. Nice. Malcolm Brogdon, Giannis Antetokounmpo, and Chris Middleton. Factions. That's pretty cool. Out of ten, that goes to the Bucks. That'll be for... Who has the Milwaukee Bucks here? Mark. Mark does. Dan Smith Jr. playing very well. And Jared Allen. Rookie credentials, this time out of 199. Jeremy Lin, out of 93. Donovan Mitchell playing very well. Kawhi Leonard trolling us. <laughs> This is the autograph, right? There it is. Jordan Bell. Another one for the Warriors. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo for William. All right. Next box. You know, this kind of this kind of reminds me of uh, well, with the the box and the design. Kind of reminds me of XR football. You guys, remember XR? XR started slow too. I don't think people were really into it early on, but then it really started to warm up. Then we couldn't keep it in stock. Good luck. Harry Giles, 149 for the Kings. Caleb Swanigan out of 149 for the Trail Blazers. There's a Fultz rookie card again. Set those aside. Nice Jason Tatum for the Celtics. Who has the Celtics? Gary has the Celtics in this one. Josh Jackson for the Suns. There's a Bogdanovich out of 92 for the Kings. More Josh Jackson. And we've got new breed autograph. Tyler Dorsey out of 149 for the Atlanta Hawks. That'll go to Jeff with the Hawks. It's Lonzo Ball. De'Aaron Fox, Kobe. Jared Allen to 299. And to Darius Thornwell, rookie card on the back, who may actually, without Blake Griffin, you know, he may get some more playing time. So that'd be good for uh, any Cinderius Thornwell collectors out there. Dust off your Cinderius Thornwell rookie cards. All right, next box. Good luck. Basketball, ladies and gentlemen, is going to be uh, is hot this year. Rookie class, I, I say this every break. The rookie class is is uh, is not only is it deep. All the rookies tend to be seem to be doing well, you know, or you you at least kind of know about them. 
You know, I, th I think that's really good. And they're on different teams, and they're doing well on different teams that traditionally have not had like a great, like a great rookie on there for a little while. If you look at the uh, if you look at the draft class, 2017 NBA draft, you know you got Markel Fultz up there, Lonzo Ball, Jason Tatum, Josh Jackson for the Suns, De'Aaron Fox. That's your top five. People know Jonathan Isaac, Laurie Markin is doing well, Dennis Smith Jr. number nine. You know uh, Kentucky's Malik Monk, Donovan Mitchell at 13, Bam Adebayo at 14. And scroll down a little bit, you got Kyle Kuzma at 27. So that's it's pretty good. You know, so I think people are pretty happy with with this draft class. I know I would be. And then you have then you have guys like Sedarius Thornwell who can kind of start to emerge a little bit as well. All right, John Collins in the mix. So, and even people like there's Clay Thompson, there's Lonzo. Trying to, I'll see if I find him. I think there's Josh Jackson, Caleb Swanigan, rookie credentials out of two ninety nine. Oh, like even guys like T.J. Leaf, he hasn't been playing that much for Indiana. Uh, but I feel like he, in, in certain sets, has been doing pretty well in the secondary market. So there's some, like, quiet value there. Out of 149, Justin Patton for the Timberwolves. Mr. Marcus Cousins again. That's out of 299. Poor Boogie Cousins. Oh, yeah, John Collins doing well. And, yeah, even Zach Collins getting regular minutes. This is Damian Lillard. Anuobi. That is out of 75. Nice one for the Raptors. Uh, that'll go to Matt. And nice Jonathan Isaac. Jonathan Isaac for the Orlando Magic. That will go to William. There you go, William. Oh, my favorite prop bet. You know, I know, I you know, I've not really paid attention to a lot of, a lot of the prop bets. Nice AI and Mike James. Um, but we'll go over some. Actually, we'll look some of those up a little bit later. Hear that? All right, six boxes to go. Do you have any favorites? Any favorite props? Does anyone? I mean, I, this guy just goes for everybody. Any favorite uh, props that they uh, prop bets that they like? I don't know. The, those 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 prop bets that Vegas puts out, and those are those are definitely those those are definitely scams. You know, no, they're not scams. I mean, you know what I mean. They they they're like. They definitely sucker you in. I mean, it's because it's it's very enticing. You know, that like you could put a couple pennies on, you know, uh, a prop bet. You could get a few more pennies, a lot more pennies back, just on some random event occurring. So, and all the other all all the like like Bovada will have different props too, all sorts of wacky props. Michael D saying New England fumbles lost under 1.5. Under, yeah, probably. Sounds like good value. Vertex is sold out, nice. So Vertex will be coming up right after this break. New breed auto, Sterling Brown for the Bucks. 83 out of 149. That goes to Mark at the Bucks. There's Jeremy Lin to 199, Justin Patton, Lonzo Ball, rookie credentials. So we'll kind of breeze through these a little more quickly now that we have a break backed up. Jared Allen out of 299. 
Kevin Garnett, KG, Timberwolves edition out of 199. There's Donovan Mitchell. Zach Randolph had a great game the other night out of 299. So Michael is saying that they've, they've only lost five total fumbles all year. So they're big on the ball protection. Andre Drummond to 99. But wh what are you getting on that under, though? Under 1.5, is that like minus 150, though, is the return? Caleb okay, Swanig in the back there. Nice. Next box. Oh, minus one, yeah, minus one eighty, but it's pretty safe though. That's that, that's a safe one. I put a, I, I can put a few pennies on that, just for entertainment value, ladies and gentlemen. All this discussion, but I think year to year, everyone everyone loves every Super Bowl. Everyone loves talking about wacky top bets. The public is betting heavy on the Eagles, boss man. Yes. To the point where where bookmakers are getting nervous because <laughs> the because the handle is not being balanced out by the Patriots. Although I think I think they figured there's a lot of a lot of people put down dollar dollar bills on yeah. Sunday, the day of the game. So I think that's where the the Patriots money will come in on Sunday. Boss man, as everybody know, and Nick Jaspi, of course, are big Eagles fans. They they are they are all in on the Eagles. There's TJ Leaf to two ninety nine. Terrence Ferguson. There is Justin Patton for the uh, Timberwolves. That's out of 24. That's a nice low number. Yeah, they've, they've been underdogs all playoffs long. And I have to say that I've been uh, I've been riding the Eagles all play playoffs long. and You've done me well. Richard Hamilton. Nice. With the mask, of course. Out of 199 for the Pistons. That'll go to Matt and the Pistons. Lori Markin and rookie card. Out of 149, Ben Simmons. Nice. Status quo to 299, Tony Parker and Jared Allen in the back. I, I would not be surprised if this card got like, I don't know, like five bucks. You know what I mean? If this Ben Simmons out of 149 got you five dollars. Easy. Right? It's just like, that's just how, and he's been playing well too. All right, see you tomorrow, boss man. So uh, I will be, uh, I don't know what everyone else's Super Bowl plans are, but I will be at the at the boss man's house for the for a little uh, Super Bowl shindig. I, I will be sure to uh, to try to to try to capture with my camera. I'll try to capture the moment of joy or moment of despair in like Nick's face or boss man's face. I don't know if I'm going to get, get quote-unquote crunk there, Arthur. I guess I could. Crash there. All 
All right, next box. Almost done with this one. Uh, and Vertex Football coming up after this. Nice Jason Tatum rookie credentials. Porzingis to 149. Gotta kind of pay attention to these because they, like, it's hard for the for to go quickly on this because my eye is on the left hand corner. Then I, I have to bring it up to the right hand corner. <laughs> this is first world breaker issues. There's Markel Fultz as Wesley Matthews out of 299. Kyle Kuzma rookie card. We'll sleeve all those up and top load them before they go out, before they ship out. And wow, there it is. Lonzo Ball, new breed. Autograph. For the Lakers, who's got my Lakers? Laker Joe Mojo going out to Mark. There you go. Mark, who is very much not a Lakers guy. He's in New England, so you can tell how he feels about Lonzo Ball. Uh, it's easier for you to sell the card, Mark. That's what it is. Easier for you to sell the card. He's been, Lonzo Ball's been banged up a little bit, so he hasn't been playing a lot lately. But, but his shooting percentage creeping up a little bit. Out of 299, Factions, Heat, Dwayne Wade, Alonzo Morning, Shaq. That's a pretty that's a pretty good trio right there. But yeah, he has been improving a little bit. Alright, nice Alonzo ball. Three boxes to go. Yeah, Rex, I'd, I'd work on some soccer. Soccer's going to be huge this year, too. Not only is it basketball is huge this year, soccer was, will be huge this year because of the uh, World Cup in the summer. I think we're going to have a nice little promo for that World Cup, too, teaser. Um, I'll tell you, folks, that every, the, when the World Cup comes around, soccer card values start to jump up a little bit. A lot of global attention on soccer. So my advice would be to get into whatever little soccer that you see tonight or today and over the next few months and get people uh, and if you're a regular seller on eBay or whatever or on a, any secondary market I would get your audience to get used to you selling soccer cards so you'll be ready to go in the summer uh, GCL saying my favorite friend bet is loser has to paint the fingernails uh, the win uh, paint their fingernails, the winner winning team's color until the paint wears off. Until it wears off. Wow, that's pretty. That's pretty brutal. Till it wears off, like maybe like a week. But till it wears off, then you then you make the, that could last forever. That could last for a long time. Then you make then you then your friends look like a uh, look like cheap floozies. Uh, Cinderi Thornwell, new breed autograph. So we're staying in LA. Royal for speed, Ryan with that one. Without Blake Griffin, Cinderi Thornwell may be one of the guys that could that could emerge. We got Malik Monk to 199 for Charlotte. Jason Tatum, rookie credentials, De'Aaron Fox. Nice Dan Smith Jr., Luke Kennard for the Pistons. Out of 299, Derek Rose. There's Kyle Kuzma. People love the Kyle Kuzma here. I'm a big fan of him. And 299, Giannis Antetokounmpo. He's been balling out. Yeah, I, I think you, I, I think you'd have to, you have to adjust the line. Yeah, it is brutal. A few Spurs here: Tony Parker, Kawhi, and Powell. Out of 149. There's Bam Adebayo. Uh, yeah, that's pretty brutal. You may have to adjust the line on that one. You would have you have to say it like a week. 
Otherwise, you're not going to find any takers. All right, second to last box. Good luck, everybody. So, uh, obviously, at the end of this break, I'll be randomizing both uh, everybody from break one and two together. And the name on top after the dice roll, after the re-randomized X amount of times, will be the winner of this break's uh, Super Bowl square. Um, the, the next break is status football. That's already full. That's another Super Bowl square. And the final Super Bowl square is going to be given away in Chronicles Basketball. So there's the link in the chat. Those, that's your last chance at squares. My craziest bet. I, I don't bet crazy. <laughs> that's just not my thing. I know. It's not the fun answer. But it's not my style. Giannis Antetokounmpo, out of 199. It's Kyle Kuzma. Ben Simmons, Magic Johnson to 199. Tyler Lydon. Zach Collins. I like those rookie credential inserts too. Lori Markinen. Right, this looks like a Christmas card right here. Uh, 136 out of 299. Kyrie, Gordon Hayward, Al Horford for the Celtics. Nice one for Boston. That'll go to Gary. Poor Gordon Hayward. All right, and the redemption. Yeah, this is this is a family show. Redemption is nice freshman signatures. Dennis Smith Jr. for the Dallas Mavericks. Chris Parent with that one. This is a nice one. There you go. Nice one, Mavs. Just too busy balling out to sign cards. It's okay, Dennis. All right. Good luck, folks. Last box, and then the randomizer, and then Vertex football. Yeah, Dennis Smith Jr. seems like the real deal, right? Like, I really feel like he hasn't has he had like any kind of slump? I feel like it's just been consistent, you know, like relative to his minutes. And it's just been like, he's just been steadily building up. More minutes he gets, the better he performs. More minutes he gets, the better he performs. There hasn't seemed to be like a, he's been consistent, I guess is what it is. It's not like he scores like a zillion points and then the next two games he scores no points, you know, but he's been extremely consistent. Yeah, that's true. I guess it would have might have been a better pick for for the Lakers, but I don't know. Yeah, see, that's the thing. I don't know if he he would have been the right because GCL just said Ghetto just said the right thing. He's on the right team too. I don't know if Des Smith Jr. would have thrived as well on the Lakers' team, whereas Lonzo I think would have or does I guess. Josh Jackson for the Suns.
John Collins, Bogdanovich out of 299. There's Kobe, status quo insert out of 299. De'Aaron Fox out of 75. Jason Tatum, nice. Donovan Mitchell also playing well. There's Ben Simmons again. And bam, bam Adebayo is your autograph at 149 for the Miami Heat. That's a nice one too. Cause with that. Jason Tatum going to Gary, of course. There's Lori at a 199. And Yvonne Rab, Ivan Rab at the end. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is your break. Now, uh, I don't have to randomize anything card wise, but we do have to randomize the Superb Owl Squares. One winner. One winner. Four squares. All right. So there's status basketball. This is break two. Here is break one. You can see on the top of the uh, screen right there from Wednesday. So we'll get Thomas down to Ryan from number one. Let's put him into this blank list right here. There's Thomas all the way down to Ryan. And then we'll grab Jeff all the way down to Jeremy. So there's Jeremy up to Jeff right here. And you saw Ryan at the end of the list right there. So there'll, there'll be 60 names on this list. Let's randomize that list. Seven times, lucky seven, six and a one. Name on top, we'll get four squares. One winner, four squares. Six and a one. One, two, three, four, five, six, and a one. Seven times. After seven times, the name on top is the suspense. Congrats to Gary. Nice, Gary. So there you go. Gary on top. Gary with four squares in the promo. Thanks very much, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.